One day, my son, Pastor Paul, called me and sent me a video of the former auditorium burnt down. Bent down to ashes. Chairs, instruments, pulpit, office, bent down. And some people said, God is trying to judge them. By burning down his house, he's trying to judge me. By burning, what Jesus are you preaching? The Jesus we are presenting before the world now is a terrorist. And I said to Pastor, I said, You go out. In less, in less than a few hours, he got another place. South Africa. You got a place of worship in a few hours. Less than 24 in South Africa. If only they knew. That God, that God was taking us out of the ghetto. In case you are not aware, we own this place. It is not rented. It is not hired. We paid cash. Hey! We own it. And when I was coming in, yes, was it yesterday evening? I looked around. I said, this area looks like church. For if they had known, they would not have crucified the Lord of glory. Sometimes, what they do is to bring out the best in you. That I had, I had stories. Some said, South Africans are angry at his ministry. God bless Bishop Zondo. He came out and said, it's not true. Another said all kinds of stories burnt, 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 house of God, burnt. Said the, said the youths were angry. Which youths? These are South Africans here. Which youths? Ha <laughs> ha! 